Today we're going to be looking at the Cleveland Tool static ports and the associated quick couplings. The static port is designed to go in a half inch hole drilled with a unibit so that it sits just proud of the surface of the aluminum. Notice that on the face of the port there's a lip which keeps the port from making contact with the inside surface. This lip allows for a thickness of ProSeal or any other bonding material to be applied to the face of the static port. Make sure there's a little bit of adhesive all the way around the flange of the port, put it through the hole, and give it a little twist as you apply pressure from the back side. Here the adhesive is cured and we're ready to install the fittings. These fittings just push on to any quarter inch shaft and an o-ring seals around the outside. Then take your quarter inch tubing, press it into the other end of the fitting and give it a little tug to make sure the ring clamps it tight. To release, just pull back on the collar and pull out the tube. To release from the fitting, the same thing, pull back on the collar and pull away from the static port. 